your bell pipe. What a bell pipe. You've got a picture of Mario on talking about me showing off my face. Um, uh, it's the police for you. The police? Yeah. Oh, guys. The police. You want to go live? Or unmute police? it. No, yeah, unmute it. The police. There you go. Speaker. It's a pressing issue. Hello? Hi, oh, is that Christopher? It is. Hi, Christopher. Sorry to interrupt you. Uh, it's PC Smith from the uh, West Yorkshire Police. We've just wanted to let you know we've had um, a report of some messages that have been going backwards and forwards over Facebook. Um, I'm sure you'll probably be aware of what it's about. Um, just need to really inform you. At this moment in time, we haven't taken any further action, but it doesn't mean it's a go ahead for this day. We can continue to What do you mean? What are you talking about? So there's been some messages to um to Samantha. Yeah, that's my missus' his sister. Yeah, that's fine. Um so obviously Samantha's called us. Um So what what has that got to do with me? Well we we there's not to believe it, Matt. It's either you or your partner that's been doing it. Um so, yeah, so it's my partner, yeah, and that's her sister. That's um, that's a domestic situation between my partner and her sister. It's got nothing to do with me. Thank you. On our end, we just need to let you know that we've got an issue with the police. Thank you. What do you mean my behaviour is not acceptable? I ain't even done anything, officer. Don't tell me, don't ring my phone telling me that my behaviour is unacceptable when I've not even done anything. I don't care, take your action. I'll ring you for awareness, right? Don't ring people's phone telling them that I've not even done anything wrong and you're telling me that it's not acceptable. She's ringing my phone for a start. Her start. Hello? Oh, it is, mate. EPS. Thank you, mate. Not... Yeah. I don't, I don't appreciate that, mate. I've not sent a message to anybody. That's my missus. Um, having a domestic situation with her sister. Yeah, and then why have my name been brought into this and you're telling me that my behaviour is not acceptable but you're not taking any further action? It's harassment, mate. It's harassment. Leave me alone. I've seen your little bacon machines outside my house for last, for last week. Well, you got an idea why they're parked outside my house for four hours at a time and now you're ringing me up, yeah, and you're telling me your behaviour is not acceptable but we're not taking any further action. Stop harassing me, Yeah. And when you want to take further action, come and see me. Stop. Well, what are you going to do? Or well, what are you going to do? You phone me up and tell me to stop shouting at you. What are you going to do about it, officer? No, you need to calm down and stop harassing me. You're sending me crazy. You're harassing me, mate. You, listen, I've had your police cars outside my house for four hours at a time. You're not talking to my partner now? In that case, what? Yeah. Okay. I'm not that interested in you, sir. You're not in, what are you ringing me for then? That's, that's it, end up, what, right? Why are you ringing me then? Listen, don't start threatening me if you start up again. I ain't even sent one message, so get on your bicycle, mate. You have your threatened to come back, man. Get on your bike. I ain't done not wrong on all my rights. What's your name, anyway? What's your name? you based at Ellen Road. I'm going to be ringing Lucy Leadbeater about this, mate. Because you know what it is, this? It's intimidation tactics. Do you know why? No, but, officer, listen, I'll calm down, right? Yeah? Do you know, let me tell you why this is intimidation tactics. Because you're ringing me up, yeah, to tell me, yeah, with no proof that I've done anything, that your behaviour is unacceptable, right? And if you carry it on, we're going to be coming to see you, yeah? Listen, you shouldn't be doing that, mate. You shouldn't be doing it. You... So why are you speaking to my partner then? Why have you asked to speak to me? You ought to speak to them too. I suspect it were you. I suspect it were you. You sent them messages. I want, I want you arrested. Yeah. It were you. It was you, mate. I'm sure it were you. 
I'm sure somebody told me it were you, and I've got a feeling it were you. And it's unacceptable. Listen, don't call my phone again. Don't call my phone again. He said it anyway, guys, so I think his name will be on this. That's a fucking weird, isn't it? Uh, you guys have seen it on here, yeah? Please car outside my house for four hours. Please car again. They ring me up, yeah, over my partner having an argument with her sister over Facebook Messenger. They want to speak to me. Oh, fucking pull my blood back, guys. Ah, oh, you're right, Marty. Respect, guys. Respect everyone, anyway. Marty just as bad. Silent game away, watching us then. Silent game away, watching us then, you mug. Jog on. About Marty just as bad. Just as bad as what? Exposing corruption and brutality. Wow, can you believe it? You got the pig live. Here, yeah, Marty as well, yeah? Um, did the police ban you from... Um... Yes, Tyrant Finder. Did the police ban you from Aldi, mate? <laughs> I ban you for me going there. Oh, what a sausage one. They wind you up, don't they? Because you know what the copper just said to me, basically, guys, yeah? He was saying, um, uh, we've got reason to believe this is you that's doing it. It's unacceptable, but we're not taking any further action. So why ring me? Why ring me? Chris, show your face, you commie. What's a commie? Tell me what a commie is, then. <laughs> Oh, thank you. Thanks, guys. You're banned from all our Aldi stores. <laughs> Silent gamers coming to get revenge. <laughs> yeah, it's coming to get revenge, man. Yeah, Silent Gamer, expose yourself. Who is it? Is it you, Luke? Getting your mates to ring, uh, crying that you're a uh, single dad and you don't want to lose your Aldi job. Fuck off. Fuck off, man. Marty, Marty how's your trip been on the uh, Peak District? Commie is a belch man. Is that belch man in the 80s? In his 80s? I'm sure these guys are smoking crack. Yeah, some of the comments, what they leave. He threatened you, basically. Yep. Yeah. Guys, where were we before that happened? Because I'm sweating now. Yeah, I'll be looking forward to that, Matt. You said earlier, um, is it based around a pharmaceutical company? Yeah, Matt, is okay. Listen, I'll tell you one thing about Marty Blackborough, guys, yeah? Um, I'll tell you one thing about Marty. Um, what you guys might see, me and Marty shouting on camera and, you know, standing up for rights and stuff like that, yeah? But you, what you haven't seen is be behind the closed door, he's got three kids there and he looks after all of them and they love him to bits and he's a great dad. Yeah, he's, he's got an happy girlfriend as well and he's got a nice house and he's got nice plans for the future and he doesn't like being bullied by authorities and corporations and councils, yeah. So what Marty does, yeah, is he, he fights out and he shouts up um, and he tries to put a stop to it, yeah. Um, because he's doing it with a common voice, right, what you get is all middle class and higher class wankers uh, coming at him. But he's a decent bloke. Listen... Do you know what gets me is all the um, working class people who come at us. And it just racks my brain. I think, what the fuck are you talking about? We're, we're trying to um, improve life um, so that we're not as suppressed as we are. And then, yeah, Marty is a legend anyway. He is. And you know what? Marty's helped my channel a lot. Um, CC as well. He helped my channel. Um, Joe Public. Listen, right, we all might have different styles, yeah, and go about it differently, but we're all in it for the same cause. He's weed-smoking drunk Marty. So fucking what? So what, Silent Gamer, what do you do? Yeah, what do you do, Silent Gamer? Do you just fucking sit there like a vegetable, mate? So what? If he has a drink, or if he has a smoke, so what? What's it got to do with you? Judgmental prick. Smoke, smoke weed and play games. Smoke weed every day. Don't get high on drugs. 
That'd be good advice. Look at Stan. Yeah, do you know this Stan Welbeck guy is ripping in comments? Get him. Tell it. Tell Stan what a muppet he is. Because that's all you say, Stan Belend. That you watch every single video and every time we're live or all like that, you, you're there, man. You're like a fucking spunk stain, you. You're like a dirty spunk stain that won't come off your boxers. Yeah? Police car outside. What? Police car. Yeah. Oh, Don't shit, guys. What? Oh, they're outside my gaff again. Me. Respect, guys. Yep, just called 999 for public order offences. Stan Welbeck, yeah, you haven't ever had a public order offence in your life, you daft cunt. <laughs> He's about public order offences. He says it all the fucking time. They're coming to get you. They're coming to get you. They are going to bang you up. Listen, for what, guys? For what? What are they going to lock me up for? Eh? Hiding my face? You're getting locked up. Stan, am I really getting locked up, mate? Am I really, though? Am I really, though, Stan? On what offence am I getting locked up? Yeah, it's funny, isn't it, that Donna? Because he is a spunk stain. Um, I once had, had my best pair of boxers, I had a spunk stain on, and I couldn't get it off. Yeah, and that's Stan Welbeck, that. He's a stubborn little spunk stain who won't go away. For being a dull doll, so we don't claim benefits here, Stan. Why did... People that talk like that. Oh, yeah, of course. Space Welshman. Uh, well pointed out, Space Welshman. A public order offence in my own house. Yeah, Stan's a copper. No, Stan's not a copper, yeah. Oh, shit. I think we're going to have a live interaction with police here, guys. Let's have a look. I'm looking out now. <laughs> Guys, please gotta to get told to fuck off on live. You're at the bar now, are you? Are you? Yeah? yeah. Oh, okay. What's up? You got a call? What's up, mate? From my sister. From who? Um, her sister, Samantha. Yeah. And? Can you open the door? No. No. Why? Why should I open the door to you? Now yeah, and I'm busy. telling you, you know what? There you go. All right. Hey, yeah, mate. It's all right. Hey, all right. Yeah, what do you want? We just want to make sure everything's all right. I'm busy, everything's fine. I'm not asking after you, I'm asking after... No, uh... I said I'm not Everything's fine, mate. Like I'm breastfeeding my baby. We don't need your business okay. here, mate. That's fine. So you're all right, then? Yeah. She's all right. Argument with you. I'm not talking, talking to you. You're not an argument with your sister? Uh, no, I'm fine, thanks. I'm good. Yeah. She is. Nobody's had an argument with my sister. She says she's had an argument with her. Yeah, well, the sister's a, a non liar. That's exactly why we're coming. Yeah. If you're no. telling me that's fine, that's fine. Yeah, yeah. everything's fine. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Thank you. Don't phone our phones again, please. All right. And come by appointment next time because we don't appreciate it. These don't appreciate you got it. Buddy. it. Yeah. Bye, guys. Say bye. Give a thumbs See up for homeless. See thumbs up for homeless people. Come on. Dickheads. Whew. It's all fucking time. This is what I deal with. You come for fuck all. <laughs>